A tame public hearing on the mayor's proposed budget unfolded at the city council this evening. But as Lena Tillett shows, as much of the attention was given to the library's budget, an issue that was personal for many supporters. Have our leaders taken leave of their library cards? The public hearing on the mayor's proposed 2016 budget is in the books, but it's access to library books that doesn't showed up to support. What are they thinking? These people on the city council have to use their own minds and vote what's best for the city. Speakers want the council to support adding $850,000 to the proposed budget. That would get to the $15.2 million budget that library officials say is needed to keep branches open and services available. Is more to discussion about where the library fits into our community and what place it holds. Library officials say more money also lets private donors know they're not dying. It is both foolish and flawed to suggest private dollars as the solution to balancing the library's budget year after year. Councilman Rich Paul says any increase might have to come during the next budget and the two sides should come together to fully understand what the other side needs. We're, we're talking at each other. And I think because each one is interpreting what their needs are differently. But after the mayor's extensive annexation package passed this afternoon, Councilman Chris Jerem raised concerns about whether the city could fund new areas and old responsibilities. We struggle now budgetarily with the library's needs. And so that, that causes me to take a step back and say, you know, perhaps we need to take a second look at such rapid expansion and growth. A concern echoed by speakers. Now, for the most part, people spoke in support of the mayor's budget plans. One group actually gave a full PowerPoint presentation on how more money to demolish vacant homes will actually make neighborhoods safer. The city council will vote on this proposed budget on August 25th at 2.15. With photographer Alex Hassel, Lena Tillett, WOWT 6 News. Thank you, Lena. The mayor has said public safety was a priority in her proposed budget with more money for police and fire.